get ready for more rain free days. Lots of sunshine. Another cold front coming through Thursday and that will help to reduce the temperatures again. And we're also monitoring the tropics right around the Caribbean. See, there's a live look outside this morning. Another clear sky start. Another cool start too. cooler than yesterday. 58 degrees at the airport. The winds are light right now. We don't have any issues with any moisture, so humidity values are low and also no fog issues out there. All 50s across the board north of the lake Slidell, Bogalusa, Hammond, 53 in Galliano, 68 degrees right now in Buras. That cold front now well east to us, pushing off the eastern seaboard of the United States. High pressure building in from the west. It's going to stay generally west of us today, so that's going to help to keep us with the nice flow from the north. Another cold frontal boundary, though, pushing to the south. This frontal boundary will push through late Thursday. In the meantime, today, high pressure building close by. It'll scoot slowly east by Thursday, so that's going to help to warm us up a bit, but this frontal boundary helps to stop the bleeding on that warm up and it will drive through Thursday night and Friday, which will help to drop the temperatures back down. Today we're looking at high temperatures still below average, but a little bit warmer than yesterday. 77 degrees by one o'clock, 80 degrees by four, and then back into the lower 70s by seven. Rain free conditions will continue. So let's talk about the tropics. We have a wave here, no, nothing tropical at this point. It's going to be moving to the west and northwest, and this is where the chance for potential development could happen uh, in the next five days. The hurricane center giving this medium odds or a 60% chance to become a depression by the weekend. So generally this should drift to the west. However, some of the moisture from the system could be spreading up north even towards Florida. You can see the impacts over the next seven days. Lots of moisture, of course, over the southern Gulf, but we're going to stay generally dry. There will be another disturbance we'll have to track over the Caribbean Sea as well. So still keeping our eyes on the tropics. We have just moved past the official peak of the season, but a lot more of the season to go officially ending November 30th. Upper 70s, low 80s today. Enjoy this afternoon. 50s tonight north of the lake. Upper 50s, low to mid 60s south. Your sunset at 647. Those daylight hours getting shorter and shorter today. Those seas two to four feet, one to two tonight, and then uh, the wind switch a little bit more northeast tomorrow, one to three feet. Here's your seven day forecast warming up ahead of that front tomorrow, cooling down into the weekend and next week back to the low 80s.